hello my lovely people welcome back to the channel once again this is quick payout we are back once again for the basketball strategy um how on how to predict overs and unders okay so if you are doing betting on basketball or it's your first time watching this view, video and you want to know how to bet on basketball join us please make sure you like the video and also watch the video to the very end okay share what you think in the comment section okay all right so um i already talked about a lot of things yesterday i'm going to continue today today i'm going to select one game as well yesterday i selected the game from the euro league so let me just pick um a match from other league so let's say the champions league let me pick a, uh, let me pick a match from here so i'm picking the first match that is galatasaray playing against uh pauk okay so i i talked about so many things yesterday today i'm going to predict overs okay i want you guys to understand so i'm going with overs only so let's say i want to predict overs for this match i told you guys that if you want to predict overs on basketball match you just don't go to the company and then select the matches but rather you come here and then you pick the matches one by one and you analyze how do you analyze this is how you analyze so the first thing i'm going to do is that i'm going to switch my app and then go to one expert the first company um i want to check the overs ranges or the overs um, options that they will give it to me so the match is in the fiba champions league galatasaray playing against paok so the total start from i want to go overs today so i'm working on overs only so the total overs start from over 154.5 over 154.5 so let me just write it there 154.5 okay so the next thing i'm going to do is that i'm going to go to um sporty bed that is the second bookmakers company and i'm going to check the options for that match all right so basketball all basketball leagues international champions league okay so this is the game all right so one ex uh sporty bet uh, also started from 144.5 144.5 they have stretched their options more than one expert okay but why why are the betting companies giving us these two different options okay one is best started from 154.5 and the sporty best started from 144.5 the analysis must prove this it must prove this yesterday i told you guys that if you want to predict total for the both teams you find the average score for each of the teams by calculating for the last five matches between both teams but today we are having a situation whereby there are only three matches between the two okay so with this we are going to use the last previous five games for each team okay not necessarily the matches between them but the la the last five games of each team that's that's what we are going to use okay so let's start with galatasaray we are going to prove why the betting companies are giving us this option one is bet 154.5 and then sporty bet 144.5 all right so uh the first thing that we are going to check is we are going to find the average score for each of the teams in their last five games so we are starting with galatasaray the first match they recorded 74 the second match they recorded 85 the, uh, the third match they recorded 93 the fourth match they recorded 79 and then the last match they recorded 87 okay so when you add all of this you get 418 418 418 so we want to find the average of the score for galatasaray in the last five matches so we divide it by five so 418 or 418 divided by five will give us 83 83 so 83 is the average score for galatasaray in the last five games which means that in the matches on the last five matches for galatasaray at least they have 83 points in each of them that is what we are trying to prove here and then the second option is that we are going to do same for pauk we are going to do same for pauk so the first match pauk had um 80 the second game they had 80 the third they had 49 the fourth match they had 64 
and then the last one they had 76 76 so when you add this together you get 349 349 so 349 divided by 5 is going to give us um 69.8 69.8 so automatically it is 70 70 so we write the 70 down after that we combine 83 that is the average score of galatasaray and then we combine 70 the average score of pauk and we get 153 153 153 so we have gotten our first answer so the time that we check for overs at one x bet okay they started from 154.5 here we find the average for galatasaray and we find it for pauk 83 plus 70 and we get 153 so automatically the score between these two teams is going to revolve around this figure that is 153 or 154 okay but it's a very very risky option very very risky option so we also want to bet for um we also want to check at one x bet okay at least we have 144.5 um from sporty bet sporty bet so um we will say it's a good option but we need to prove why uh they started from here okay before we will bet for this okay. so the thing that you do is that you come to check for the strong team okay yesterday i show you how to find a strong team so today the strong team will be galatasaray because when you check the previous matches they won two out of three and then uh, when we find the average score they had 83 whilst pauk had 70 so they are the strongest team here so what we are going to do is that we are going to pick the least results from galatasaray's last five matches so when you check in their last five matches we will pick the least results so after um looking through the least results will be the last but what match that is the match between basa Sahel and then galatasaray so 67 79 67 79 so that's the least results in the last five games for um galatasaray so when you combine this uh this 67 plus 79 you are going to get total of 146 146 okay 146 so uh, that's the reason why sporty bed started their alls from 144.5 144.5 so it means that the results is going to uh, be being around here that's why they have also reduced the alls so 144.5 is 1.22 or that's a very small alls but if you want safety we can pick um over 145.5 at least there should be a result of once 146 146 146 so let me just place the game and then we will see after the match okay so this is how this is how you prove this is how you prove and you pick a very correct option you have to compare the odds between the two betting companies or the betting companies okay and then pick the correct one pick the correct one this is another part of the video tomorrow i also come again with another video how to predict individual total individual total we are going to learn a lot of things on this channel please if you're new on this channel make sure you subscribe and then also join my telegram use the link in the comment section join the telegram channel share your thoughts on this video and then let's improve a lot of things see you guys tomorrow bye